Hey guys, we are back with another review. Today we have a surprise for you. We are at the Tractor Supply. Take a look at the Tractor Supply. In Vero Beach, but it's the one a little bit more north. So we're at a place called Gigi's Respadas. That is Gigi's Respadas. So I have never had anything like this. The best way that I could describe what they have is a little bit of Soul Cow slash Mexican street food. So they have some yummy stuff. As I'm doing the review, because I have no idea what to expect, they're actually going to explain what I'm eating because I have never had SoCal Mexican street food, but they told me it is, it is amazing. I'm excited. They use some really unique different treats. Everything is homemade. They make it at home, obviously. It's then prepared on the truck and given to us. So let's see what that Mexican street food working with. All right, guys, as you know, we are at Gigi's Respada. So again, we have some cool, unique treats. And we're going to be starting out with, take a look at this. So what's your name again? Daisy. Daisy. So we're here with Daisy. This is the owner's wife. So take a look at this. Oh my gosh. So these here are uh, Mexican tostitos. Okay. So Mexican tostitos. Uh, and what do we got? Uh, so they're served with uh, shrimp ceviche. Okay. So it's served actually with a shrimp ceviche. Yeah. All right. Come in a little closer. And do you want to tell me anything else about this? Yeah, so what these, do we got here? These are called tosti ceviche. Yep. Um, the ceviche is uh, made with lime. Uh, cucumber. Lime, cucumber. Uh, purple onion. Purple onion. Uh, cilantro. Cilantro. And then uh, tomato. And tomato. Yeah. Look at those nice shrimp. We got the nice shrimp and what, and what Gabriel told me is these special chips are actually flown in from California. So again, this is what you would consider more of a Mexican street food. And I've been here for a long time. I've never seen anything like this in Treasure Coast. So again, guys, we're at the Tractor Supply, North Vero Beach, very close to Sebastian. Now, how much would this normally cost? $10. All right, $10. Now, should I just dive in, yes. take a bite, and take a bite you of the chip? You can take the chip. You can just take Ooh, a look bite. look at that. Take a look at that. All right, I'm going to jump right in. Thank you so much. Thank it you. looks great. Thank you, Daisy. All right, good. Tosti ceviches, baby. Tosti ceviches. We're going to jump right in. All right, look at that. We got the shrimp. We got all these fresh ingredients. Got the spicy tostito. I'm tasting the ceviche. Definitely more of a pickle flavor. The ingredients are very fresh. I'm also tasting that hint of almost like a sweet vinaigrette flavor. Look at that. This is super sweet, fresh, but definitely, you know, almost like a, a pickle flavor as well, which is that ceviche flavor. You got the fresh shrimp. Mm. It's fresh, it's refreshing, it's not too filling. The ceviche is extremely fresh. The shrimps are really nice size. I do like the added flavor of the flaming Hot Tostitos. Guys, this is obviously different than anything I've ever had. It is so fresh and unique. Like I said, this is something you would find in California that is pretty popular there. Will it get popular here? We'll see. What they're really trying to do is show Treasure Coast something really unique and fresh and something that is really going to be close to that SoCal Mexican street food kind of thing. But honestly, I think it's really good. It's a little bit outside of my normal comfort zone. But again, take one last look. Really good. Really unique. There's so many flavors in there. Guys, I'm actually going to go 8.5. 8.5 on this. I forgot what it was called already. 10 bucks. You can't beat that full bowl baggy food. AZ, I know that we have the chimango because I read it right there. So tell what is the ch Now the chimango is normally 10 bucks, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. So explain what this beautiful drink is. So is the, it a drink? Yes. It is. Okay. Um, so the chimango is a Mexican mezcal, um, which is uh, Mexican shaped ice. So we make the flavor with real fruit. Mm -hmm. uh, the chimango has chamoy tahini. Ooh, chamoy and, uh, tahini. Yes, what lime. else? Lime. Lime. And then it also has a mango chunk. Wow. And what is this for? Oh, the spoon to cut it Yeah, and then this is the tamarind candy. Oh, candy. so you got the tamarind candy on here? Yes. Okay. Mm, I like that. So it's almost like a fruit roll-up. Okay. Do you remember a fruit roll-up? Yes, okay. Yes. Is that what it tastes like to you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. With a little bit of like mm. the, I would say like a sour mm. kick to it. Yeah. A little spicy. So, what's the what's the sour one? Is it the chamoy? It's the chamoy. Yeah. Okay, so as you guys know, we have the chamango. 
So again, this is a Mexican street food type of thing. So this would be considered more of a drink or a drink snack type thing together. More of a snack, yeah. Ooh. Like a drink snack. Also, awesome. yeah. and this is mango and everything, right? Yes. Cool. Yeah, so we make the mango bowl. Sweet, thank you so much. Sweet, but also sour from from this thing, from the chamoy. Definitely tasting those fresh ingredients, the mango. Very interesting. Sweet, sour, but very refreshing, especially on a hot day. Guys, this is so unique, so crazy. I have never had anything like this. This is like a sweet and sour drink. Definitely unique. If you're looking for this, I think you're gonna love it because all the ingredients are fresh. 8.2 on the Chimango. 8.2, $10, cool, refreshing. You got the Chamoin. Right, last but not least, so Daisy, look at that. That's actually so pretty. This is, let me guess, hold on. This is the Fresa. Yes, it is. This is the Fresa Respato. So tell me a little bit about this one. So the Fresa Respato is the strawberry flavor. Uh, strawberry flavor. Yeah. So same concept as a Chamango. We Ooh. make this one with real strawberries as well. So real strawberries, and if we were to describe this, it is really a fresh strawberry drink. Yes. Okay. Yes. With strawberry chunks. Day. Awesome. Awesome. Thank you so much, Daisy. Really good. Nice to meet you. This stuff is amazing. Here we go. I'm going to jump in. Thank you so much. Okay. I love this one. And I'm going to tell you why. Obviously, you have fruit drinks out there. You have smoothies and all that stuff. Guys, this is a pure, fresh strawberry drink. All of his ingredients are fresh. This is like eating the freshest, best smoothie with strawberry chunks that you're gonna get, eight bucks. They have all different flavors, show them the flavors of the Respados. Everything is fresh, everything is homemade. They're buying the fruits and everything. Wow, that pure sweetness from the strawberry. I love this one. This is something I could vibe with. This is some, obviously, this is still a SoCal Mexican street food, uh, but obviously this goes to as simple, but as fresh as you can get. On the Fresa Respato, the actual strawberry, 9.1, 9.1, ladies and gentlemen. Guys, if you're ever in North Vero Beach and you are near the tractor supply up here in North Vero Beach, come and try you Gigi's Respatos for some amazing, Mexican street food and the freshest drink fruit smoothie that you're going to get, fruit drink, whatever you want to call it. That was another review. Baldy out.